Today I'm going to walk you through a quick demo of a new feature that we just launched in Dashru, uh, dashboard emails. So you can now send your dashboards via email to your customers or colleagues or clients directly from within your Dashru account. So let's uh, walk you through that right now. So the first thing you want to do is find the dashboard that you want to send by email and click on the email icon at the top of the dashboard. Once you do that, you'll be able to set the recipients who should receive this dashboard. So I'm going to go ahead and uh, type that in. And once I've done that, I can determine the frequency in which this dashboard should be emailed out. So the default is just to send it as a one-time email, uh, but you do have some options for the frequency either being uh, every day, uh, every week, or every month. And as you choose things like weekly or monthly, you'll notice um, some more options available to you. So you can choose which day of the week you'd like to send it on, um, which day of the month. Um, uh, so you'll be able to make those selections from the drop-down menus. So in this case, I want to send it uh, weekly uh, uh, every Friday. So I'll go ahead and make that uh, my selection. Once you've done that, um, you can also decide uh, what data, what the data range should be for the dashboard when it gets emailed out. So the default will be to send that dashboard uh, showing the last 30 days worth of data. If you'd like to make that uh, a little bit more restricted, you can show the last two weeks, uh, just the last week of data, or actually create a custom date range as well. I'm going to just leave it as the default for this demonstration, um, so I'll be sending that out showing the last 30 days of data. From there, I can go ahead and schedule the email, and it will go out um, on the, uh, the Friday of the week. But if I wanted to customize the settings of that email, um, I can do so by just checking the box. So if I wanted to add a custom subject line, so custom subject here, uh, include a more personalized message to my recipients, you know, please review this dashboard, take a look at the numbers, let's chat when you've uh, got a free moment, you can do that. And you can also add a, a custom um, from label as well. So I'm going to add uh, Acme Agency as uh, my from, from label. And once I'm done, I just click schedule email and I'm all set. So now that I have the email scheduled, if I needed to go back and make changes to it, I can just click on the link for view all scheduled emails and it pulls up a, a window that shows me uh, how many recurring dashboard emails I have in, in play right now. If I wanted to make any changes, I can go ahead and edit those to change the recipients. I can change the frequency in which they're sent, change the uh, subject and custom message as well. So it's very easy to set these up, again, as a one-time email out to one or more recipients. Or again, if you're an agency or managing multiple clients, uh, you might want to set up a variety of recurring dashboards to generate these reports on a daily, weekly, monthly basis. Uh, really saves time and adds some automation into your, your workflow so you can uh, get on to doing other important things for, for your business. So uh, real quick, just to kind of start from the beginning, once you've had your dashboard set up and you're ready to send that out, uh, a couple ways you can enter the workflow. You can either click on the email icon at the top of the dashboard. Uh, in the share menu, there's also an option for emailing dashboard. Again, pulls up the same uh, window. And last but not least, in our settings panel, um, you can go and find uh, a list again of all of your scheduled emails. So anything that you've set up that you want to review and then go make changes to, uh, you'll be able to do that there. So great. We're hopefully, uh, um, hopefully you'll be excited to use this feature. We know it's been a very popular feature request and uh, would love to hear your feedback. So let us know. Thank you.